you know, you cited a number of studies on competitiveness and, um, you know, studies on competitiveness are, <laughs> they're, they're multiple. And we did hear, uh, the commission heard that of our 15 competitive states, we ranked number three, which I thought was pretty good. Uh, you cited other studies. You didn't cite that one, interestingly, but but you cited other studies that showed we were worse. Um, the the one issue that's, that's, that stands out is that I know the Chamber of Commerce and people, uh, the business people on the commission promoted was this single factor apportionment, uh, and that's a $154 million hit to the budget. And uh, I'd like to repeat what I suggested at the in the Blue Ribbon Commission, uh, and that is, this this is a positive um, uh, position to take in attracting businesses, but I'm not convinced that just putting it out there for all businesses um, as a as a gift, so to speak, uh, uh, is going to guarantee one single job. Uh, perhaps a better strategy, and I think of being uh, a good strategist that you are, um, and the governor, it might be better to actually add that. To the quiver, uh, to the quiver of the economic development cabinet, so that if they get a business that objects that we don't have this, you can say we have this available to you. If you come to our state, we can we can provide this as an incentive to bring bring jobs here. Um, I, I'm just not convinced that when you try to always scale back your taxes to corporations to try to meet, match competitive states, that that is really good strategy. Um, and I think that that's something that we can continue to debate as well.